my hope with this CD is that it should evoke the, the idea of Spain. I come from a very cold country in the north, and perhaps I have that in common with, with people here in England, is that I think Spain, more than any other European country at least, for us kind of symbolizes something completely different. Jacob and I decided that we would like to explore a little bit further what, what this thing is with Spain in music. It's not necessarily the country, but it's almost like a musical style. And that goes all the way back to Albanis, who tried to find, to find for himself what Spain was, to have a, a composer like Pete Harden that goes back to the original Rodrigo concerto and sort of twists it into a sort of more heaty, steamy kind of Spain. to record such a piece. So many beautiful recordings of this piece that I grew up listening to and you know partly is maybe one of the reasons why I chose to play this instrument. So obviously the difficulty is more trying to get those things out of your system before starting to prepare for, for a recording like this and try to look at it with uh, new eyes. And there I must say I've had a tremendous help uh, of uh, my close collaboration with, with the conductor Christian Carlsen and we have given that we have been working for so many years together on different concertos. What is so beautiful about the Rodrigo piece also is the amount, the playfulness of the piece and the amount of freedom it gives in, the, in trying to find new colors in it and I spend a lot of time together with Jakob preparing for this city, just trying to find some new colors that maybe have never been heard in this piece and trying to go back to this flamenco influence of it that Rodrigo had. True joy of working with the London Philharmonic Orchestra on this project. Accompanying the guitar is, is a challenge, and what is so ex extraordinary about the LPO is the way they listen to everything. You, they listen to every note that he plays and and sort of fills in and supports him and builds up from underneath. And it's just been a beautiful recording session in that sense. To be honest, I think the Rodrigo came into the idea of the CD as a consequence of the contemporary pieces, not the other way around. I got the idea for this CD listening to the beautiful piece of, of uh, Francisco Kohl that we recorded in the north of Sweden uh, a couple of years ago. And all of a sudden, Aranjuez popped up in my head. I really realized that these two pieces belong together on a CD. They have something in common. This CD will be able to take the listeners through the guitar history of the last hundred years, basically, going from the first major guitar concerto up to something written just a couple of years ago. Mm -hmm. 